going to discuss the NCERT back exercise problem that is 15 of solution chapter. We have given the an aqueous solution of 2% by mass of non-volatile solute which exerts a pressure of 1.004 bar at the normal boiling point of the solvent. We have given that percentage by mass of the non-volatile solute is 2% and the vapor pressure of the aqueous solution at the boiling point is 1.004 bar. So it means that the vapor pressure of the water is 1.013 bar. P0 for water at the boiling point is 1.013 bar at the normal boiling point. So vapor pressure of aqua solutions 1.004 bar is directly given to us but it was specified that it is at boiling point of the solvent. So it means that the at the boiling point of the solvent vapor pressure of pure water is 1.013 bar or 1 atm. To find out the molar mass of the solute by using the P0 minus P by P0 equal to the mole fraction of solute which is N by N plus N where N is the mole of the solute and capital N is the mole of the solvent. As the mole of solute is very very less as compared to the solvent we can assume that N plus N approximately capital N where capital N is the mole of the solvent. is 1.013 bar and the vapor pressures of solution is 1.004 bar. Now we have given the 2% by mass of the non-volatile solute. This is given to us. So what does it mean? It means that mass of solute is 2 gram and the mass of solution is 100 gram. Means in 100 gram of solution, 2 gram of the non-volatile solute is present. So mass of the solvent would be 98 gram and solvent is water as it is given the aqueous solution. Now placing the values in the formula that is P0 minus P by P0 equal to the mole of solute by mole of solvent. We have neglected here the mole of solute as the mole of solute is very very less compared to the mole of solvent. So P0 which is 1.013 and vapor pressure of solution is 1.004 and the mole of solute is given mass that is 2 gram by the molar mass and this mole of solvent is 98 is the mass of solvent that is water divided by the its molar mass which is 18. We can simplify and we can find out the molar mass of the solute which is 41.35 gram per mole.